early in the morning, and despite a bitter chill in the air, thousands have turned out to witness the launch of Germany's newest luxury liner, the Aida Luna. The ocean giant is setting off on a 42-kilometer trip along the River Ems to the open sea. We arrived yesterday. We always come when there's a ship leaving the Maya shipyard. I've seen loads of Aida ships in the Caribbean. They're so beautiful, I wanted to see this new one too. We've booked a trip on the Aida Luna for my 50th birthday in October, so I wanted to get a look at my boat beforehand. I'd love to be able to go on board and have a look around. We kept checking on the internet to see how the building was going, and today we said we'd come and see the launch no matter what the weather even though it was a very long drive. Just after midday, the 252-meter-long giant is finally set into motion, assisted by two towboats. The ship enters the water aft first to make it easier to maneuver. Gliding out of the dock without a hitch, it's so close, spectators can almost touch it a unique experience for many. It's wonderful. I'm so glad I was able to experience this. It's so exciting every time. I would recommend it to anyone. Papenburg is a quaint town with a population of 35,000. Many locals make their living in the shipbuilding industry. And even without luxury liners, the Meyer shipyard attracts thousands of tourists. Last year, there were 300,000 visitors in all. The shipyard here is a family business, dating back to the 18th century. The ships are built entirely in dry docks. The Meyer shipyard is the world's biggest dry dock. It has a total length of 504 meters. And so visitors can come and see the ship as it's being built stage by stage. The Meyer shipyard is always working on two luxury liners at one time. It takes just over a year to build one ship. The Aida Luna is one of the smaller ships made here. Back out on the river, the Aida Luna is now making good progress. The level of the River Ems has to be artificially raised to allow the gigantic vessel to pass through. And a special dam was built for just that purpose. But there are still two very narrow sections that are a particular challenge. The entire route is lined with spectators. The launch of every ship is a big event in this region. I always find an experience like this overwhelming. I often go on cruises, and so it's particularly meaningful for me to be able to witness the launch of a ship's maiden voyage. Just before midnight, the Aida Luna finally reaches Emden on the North Sea. It took the ship almost 12 hours to travel 42 kilometers. The Meyer shipyard is due to finish its next cruise liner in June and the spectators will once again be back in force to witness another spectacular launch.